Hot Stove Baseball Talk. Dodgers tailgate out here in Rancho Cucamonga. My name is Stephen Douglas, and you're inside the Dodgers Affiliates Minor League Report. This is our third installment of the report, and the goal here is basically to shout out players that are doing well in the Dodgers Minor League system. I love baseball. I love prospects. So here we are doing a rundown of Oklahoma City, Tulsa, Great Lakes, and Rancho Cucamonga scores, highlights, stats, and players of the week. We'll have all that for you on this report. In AAA, the Oklahoma City Dodgers had last night off, and tonight they face the San Diego Padres affiliate, where the Dodgers continue to have rehab appearances from Zach McKinstry and Cody Bellinger, as well as Tony Gonsolin. Tonight, the OKC Dodgers fall 6-4 to four to El Paso, both Cody Bellinger and Zach McKinstry were one for four with a run scored in this contest. Turning our attention to double A, the Tulsa Drillers won last night 10 to two. Ryan Pepio with the start, three and a third innings, no runs, one hit, eight strikeouts, but he did have three walks. Ryan Noda was two for five, two home runs. He now has six on the season, also had three RBIs and two runs scored. As far as tonight's game, the Drillers pull this one out. Took 13 innings to do so, 6-2 to two over Arkansas. Michael Bush with a home run in the 13th inning to help the Drillers cause. And good bullpen work from Tulsa. Great Lakes on the road in Lansing. Last night's ball game, Leonel Valera hit a three-run home run. That's his sixth on the season in solid pitching performance from Jose Martinez. He gets the win Five innings pitched, three strikeouts. And tonight, the Loons do it once again, winning 10-1. to one. Good team win for the Loons. James Outman had two hits in three at-bats. RBI, two runs scored, and two stolen bases. He now has eight on the season. Our minor league player of the week is Sarin Lau. Hit 440, 11 hits, a home run, and four RBIs. Started off slowly for the Quakes but had a big week last week for Rancho. Congratulations to Mr. Lau. Also, some more congratulations around Rancho, and that's for the promotion for Diego Cartaya. Cartaya already getting things going as far as the bat in Rancho Cucamonga. Last night went three for five with his first home run in low A for the Quakes. He's now hitting 500 in his first two games. Had the night off tonight. John Shoemaker's club started the night off slow with the bats. Good pitching from Carlos Duran. Three innings, three hits, no walks, eight strikeouts. Yorbit Vivas takes this pitch out of the park to right center field. That gets the Quakes on the board. And then Brandon Lewis with a double in the ninth inning. That scores Sam McWilliams and Jake Vogel ties the game but the Quakes would fall in extra innings as Stockton Ports pick up the victory 5-3.